Hello everybody, this is Scott and I am back with another video and today I'll be showing you how to quickly uh, just pin the pin uh, programs to this taskbar. Uh, I actually got one of the comments before and uh, yes, these are just random programs that I've uh, that I commonly use. Uh, Internet Explorer, Chrome, Handbrake, Video Compression Tool, uh, TS, TeamSpeak 3, uh, GIMP, Windows Movie Maker, and uh, Bandy, well Bandicam's not pin. But seriously, the only thing you really need to do is you just find a program and you click right click when it's open and click pin this program to taskbar now I can't close it because I'm using it to record but uh, I'll give you an example with Google Chrome I open Chrome and it's got this little thing I close it on Chrome and it's still there that's pinned to the taskbar it'll always be there and you can always retrieve it there is another way you go into your start menu and you'll ha just find one of the programs like advanced system care I have it you right click on it to where there's a little check mark for Windows 8 and click pin to taskbar and now if I'm going to head back to the uh, desktop look at that it's now pinned to the taskbar and that's all you need to do to pin them um, I recommend doing this for only like commonly used programs and ones that you actually use a lot and don't want cluttering up your screen like if I pinned it here I'm not going to use I don't need this here uh, I don't need this here and I'm gonna keep all these for YouTube stuff. I should move these all over here actually. Out of the way, like my YouTube stuff should go over there. Not the point though. Uh, I'm not gonna use that. Don't need it. My work folder, I don't even know what this is. I'm not gonna bother. Uh, TeamSpeak 3, I don't need that. Uh, Bandicam, it's already pinned. And that's all you need to do. It cleans up so much space because I notice people, like I don't know how you manage to do this, but like nobody uses folders anymore on their desktop. I see screens and they're just cluttered everywhere with just applications and I know they don't use all those applications. I've seen people with ones that aren't even installed on there. It's like what's the point of having it? It makes no sense. You're wasting your time. But that's just my two cents about it. So uh, thank you very much for watching. Please stay tuned for another video and I'll be back with some more tips for your computer. So thank you very much for watching and goodbye.